G'day cheeky dogs, my name's Monkey and I'm an Australian currently living in America. You want to hear a fairy tale that is true? Yes please! Well I've got a theory for you. And today we're going to discuss whether or not this scene in season 3 episode fairy tale is a flashback of Chili or is it actually a flashback of her older sister Brandy. This episode of Boo is called Fairy Tale. I'm going to go through all the points for Brandy as well as all the points for Chili and then at the end give my opinion on which one I think it is. Well, I guess you have to decide. But I would love to know from you guys in the comment section down below, who do you think that this little red healer is? Also, if you haven't hit that subscribe button and bell for notifications, make sure you do that as well while you're leaving your answer below. So on the first watch of this episode, you might automatically think, yeah, sure, of course, this little red healer is chilly. Is that mum? But there are a lot of theories popping up as to why it could be her big sister Brandy. For those of you who don't know who Brandy is, we actually see her for the very first time in the picture frames in season 3A of Bluey, and we meet her in season 3B in the episode onesies. Hey Brandy. Hi Chili. It's good to see you. Yeah, you too. Kids, this is your auntie Brandy. I've actually already done a whole breakdown as to why we haven't seen Brandy in a long time in a different theory video, as well as an updated one as to why she doesn't have any kids, so I'll leave a link for those videos in the description box down below and a tag up here as well. But basically, we haven't seen Brandy in four years because her and Chili had a pretty bad disagreement over the idea of children. Why can't she just have the thing she wants? Because it's not meant to be. So that's who Brandy is. Now, why could it be her and not Chili in the episode fairy tale? The main evidence pointing to it being Brandy is the fact that Chili says that she doesn't remember this interaction at all. But I've got no memory of that happening. This actually links up with the episode The Show, where when reenacting how Bandit and Chili first met, Chili actually says, Um, why did you meet Dad? Well, there's some dispute. But let's just say at a party in London. Of course it's up for debate because it turns out that Bandit thinks that they actually met when they were kids. That is not how it happened. Oh, yes it was. Whereas Chili thinks that they met when they were in London. Blow out your candles, your majesty. Very well. I don't remember the queen being there. You wouldn't. But when Bandit is telling his flashback 80s story, she does say that they used to go to that area a lot on holidays when she was a kid. We did used to go on holidays to that caravan park. Case closed. That means that both her and Brandy could possibly have been in this scenario. From the childhood photo we see in season three of Chili and her family on the wall, we can tell that Brandy is possibly two years older than Chili based on the height difference, which is similar to the height difference between Bluey and Bingo. And the little red healer that Bandit meets looks to be around his age as well, and it is a assumed that Bandit is just a little bit older than Chili. So again, this could point to it being more Brandy, who could have been around the same height as Bandit, rather than Chili. Now, the main thing that seems to be going against the idea of it being Brandy is the fact that the colouring of this little red healer does match the colouring of Chili. However, we have to keep in mind who is visualising this flashback. This story set a long, long time ago in a place called the 80s. That's me when I was 10 years old on holiday with your Uncle Rad and Uncle Stripe. At first, you might think that it's Bandit who's visualising the flashback, seeing as it is his story that he is retelling to the girls. So, of course, in his mind, he sees the little red healer looking like his wife, Chili. Because it happened to me. Ooh. However, throughout the Bluey series, we can definitely tell that every single episode is from the girl's perspective or a child's perspective. And that's why magic seems to exist in this universe, because everything is from the kid's perspective. It's also why the healer house just has no actual floor plan, because as children, we see our houses as being bigger and more magical than what it is. So if it's from the girl's point of view, then how did they know what everyone looks like? Well, we can see in season three more photos of Bandit and his brothers when they were around that age up on the walls around the house. So that's how the girls are able to imagine what they look like. And I'm sure there's probably pictures of Nana and her perm, as well as of Grandad Bob around too. So they're able to visualize that. So of course then the little red healer that their dad is telling them is Chili is going to make them visualize her as the same color scheme as their mum, Chili. Is that mum? That's mum. What? Cheeky dogs, if you've been enjoying this video so far, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up down below and leave a comment. It really means a lot to me into helping build my channel. And the YouTube gods also seem to like channels that have lots of likes in them as well. Now, the only thing that I think would be able to tell us whether or not this is definitely chili or definitely brandy 
is the She-Ra costume that the little red healer is wearing. Perhaps next time we're at Grandad's house, we might see a little hint towards this costume, maybe in a box or in a hallway closet or even an old photo. This would then definitely confirm that it is Chili or Brandy. Don't listen to him, it wasn't me. Don't listen to her, it was. Now, of course, Chili might not remember this interaction because to her, it wasn't really anything special to remember. Well, look, it might have been, but I've got no memory of that happening. Oh, it's like a dagger in my heart. Whereas to Bandit, it was something really significant because this girl helped break the curse that he'd been going through for days. So of course he's going to remember this interaction so much more. Here you go. Thanks. See you later. Yeah. See you later. EMOTIONAL DAMAGE! Whereas the little red healer with the she costume might not remember it at all. So that could be why Chili doesn't remember it and it could actually still be Chili. But what do I think? Do I think it's Chili or Brandy? To be honest, I would love to think that it's Chili. I think it makes for such a gorgeous story and a perfect fairy tale ending for the healers. And we know that this universe is mostly full of happy endings. Either way, it's a good story. But is it true or not true? I need to know. Well, I guess you have to decide. Do you believe in fairy tales? But it is hard to ignore the fact that perhaps it could be Brandy or it could just be another little red healer somewhere that we haven't met yet. But then who broke the curse? What do you guys think though? Leave your answer in that comment section down below. I'd love to hear if you have any more ideas as to why it could or couldn't be Chili or Brandy or maybe even just another red healer we haven't met yet. I'll have some more theory videos and of course breakdowns of Bluey episodes coming out over the next few weeks. So make sure again to hit that bell for notifications so you know when these videos come out. If you don't live in Australia like me, but you want to watch season three, I made a whole video about how you can watch Bluey season three worldwide. I go through it step by step as to how to use a Nord VPN to watch Bluey online for free. Uh, no, this video is not sponsored and I am an affiliate though with Nord VPN. It's what I use so that I can watch season three and make all these videos about it. So I go through how to set up your Nord account as well as how to set up that it's in Australia. So then your internet thinks that you are in Australia as well. And then we go over to the ABC iView website for Australia where Bluey season three is aired, how to set up your account on that as well. And then where to go on the website so that you can access Bluey season three. And you can also access season one and season two, including the episodes Dad Baby, as well as Teasing, which you can't always find on Disney, depending on what country that you live in. But until then, I have picked you cheeky dogs out a few other videos that maybe you would like to watch, and I will see you all in another video. Bye.